the objective of this activity is to find the sum of two decimal by activity method yes we are going to use an activity to add decimals let's understand the concept in hand first suppose you have decimals like 23.5 and 7.28 see the number of digits in front of decimal are two here and one here so the number of digits differ and likewise the number of digits after decimal is one here and two here so they also differ what we do to add the decimals is we write the first number and then we write the second number below the first number in such a way that the decimal comes exactly under the decimal and so we can write 7 here 2 here and 8 here now we will use a horizontal line to add vertically this column has nothing here so it is a 0 here so 0 and 8 they add up to 8 5 and 2 they add up to 7 7 and 3 they add up to 10 so we have a 0 and a 1 carry 2 plus 1 gives us 3 and therefore 30.78 is the sum of these two decimals this is how you add decimals we can do this using activity method also let's see what is the material required to perform that activity we required squared paper sketch pins geometry kit and a pair of scissors for cutting work let's perform this activity now to perform this activity of adding decimals we have taken two decimals 0 0.43 and 0 0.43 3, 2 and we are going to try to add them using this particular grid which we have cut out from a chart paper. You can see here this grid contains uh, 10 squares along the length and 10 along the width. So the total number of squares is 100. That means it is a 10 by 10 grid. Now what do you have to do on this grid? The first decimal here is 0 0.43. So you will be shading 43 small squares out of these 100 and you will get a grid like this so i have already shaded it for you 10 10 10 10 and 3 so it makes 43 this shaded part represents 0 0.43 because it is 43 out of 100 and then the next one is 0 0.32 so on the same grid, you will be shading another 32 small squares. So here I have done it already using a different color. I have shaded 10, 20, 30, 31, 32, 32 small squares. So you just have to count how many total squares are shaded here or you can count the unshaded squares like 7 here and then 8 here, 7 and 8, 15 and then 10, 25. So 25 remain unshaded. So 100 minus 25, that is 75, they are shaded. And 75 out of how many? 75 out of 100, that is 0 0.75. So 0 0.75 is the sum of 0 0.43 and 0 0.32. And that completes our activity on adding decimals.